am Dr. Abdelaziz Abdelrahman, a senior lecturer and also the head of department for information science. This department happens to be one of its kind in the whole of the country. The department can actually boast of a wide range of experienced teaching staff. Their experience stems from two angles. One, they have an experience from industry and secondly, they also have academic experience. The department runs a Bachelor of Technology in Library and Information Science. This particular program is run in two streams. The first stream is the regular version and the other stream is the weekend version. The department also runs a Bachelor of Technology in Library and Information Science. The department also runs a two-year diploma in library and information science. This particular diploma program is run in the evening. The department intends and plans are actually far advanced in this direction to mount new programs. And these are Bachelor of Technology in Management knowledge, record management, information and social media management. My name is Samuel Amwakon, a lecturer and exams officer to Department of Information Science. Currently, the department runs two programs, that is Diploma in Library Information Science and then BTEC in Library and Information Science. These are the requirements. For diploma, WASI and SSC universe must have four passes, including English, language, and mathematics. And then mature applicant must be 25 years or above. They must have a proof that they have 25 years and above. Then the requirement for BTEC in Library Information Science are with SSC and OAC levels, you must have credit passes in six subjects comprising three core subjects that is English, Language, Mathematics, and Integrated Science, and then three elective courses. Holders of diploma in Library and Information Science or equivalent in any accredited institution will be admitted at level 200 or second year. Mature applicant should have or must be 25 years or above. They will be required to have two years experience and a proof from their employers to show that they have two years working experience. They will also be required to write examination organized by the institution. the acting head of Kumasi Technical University Library and a lecturer at the Department of Information Science. As a pioneer developers of the Information Science program, of which we are currently running Diploma in Library Information Science and Bachelor's of Technology in Library Information Science, the program open up a lot of opportunities for the graduate of the program. First and foremost, the graduate of the program will work in academic libraries. When I talk of academic libraries, I'm talking about university libraries, school libraries, polytechnic libraries, and colleges of education libraries. These libraries like professional staff to work in the library. Then again, with the passage of the RTR bill, which has now become a law, the government is supposed to provide officers in the various government departments who will be in charge of managing the bill or implementing the bill. And these are the graduates of library and information science program. When you go to research centers like CSR and others, 
they need librarian, professional librarian, professional information officers who are there supporting the researchers by providing their information needs. And these are the people we are training in this institution and the Department of Information Science. When you go to banks, especially Bank of Ghana, they recruit these students as their staff to work in their library, to manage the library as well. Then again, you go to uh, GMPC, you go to Tolo Oils and others. They all need information officers to manage the information centers. Then the public libraries, all the community libraries need professionals. There are colleges of education, nurses training college that do not have professional librarians. And when these people go through this program and they pass their courses, there's a huge job opportunity in all the places I've mentioned. Currently, the department is running the bachelor's and the diploma. In the future, we have already finished with the curriculum to run records management program, knowledge management program, and information and social media management program. The prospective students who want to enroll in this program should visit the university website.